Hello, welcome to the pencil pin wheel. We're going to play a little game to give you the perfect pencil pinch. This video works well for right-handed folks. However, left-handed folks can use it too. We'll just reverse step one. So step one, put your pencil facing left. The left-handed folks can put it facing right. But as you can see for this video, it is facing left for the right-handed folks. Okay, you're going to need to make a claw for this one. So look, I have two fingers and a thumb making a little claw. It kind of looks like a crab claw, doesn't it? Let's look at it one more time. It is two fingers together and they're pinching with the thumb. It's making a little claw. So let's take our claw and we're going to pick up the pencil right at the paint. We're not going to touch the wood. We're just going to touch the paint of the pencil with our claw. We're going to pick it up and we're going to pinwheel it around with the other hand. All the way around, and then, boop, it bumps the hand. And look at that, we have the perfect pencil pinch. Wow, it's beautiful. Let's look at it one more time. Here comes the claw. Oh, look at that claw, two fingers and a thumb. And we'll pinch right at the paint of the pencil. And we're going to pinwheel it around all the way until, Boop, it bumps the hand. Oh, what a beautiful pencil pinch. Okay, we need to make sure this is a good pencil pinch. So let's take a good look. Let's look at the pointer finger. It's pointing at the point of the pencil. We like that. Thank you, pointer finger, for pointing to the point. What else can we look at? Let's look at the long finger underneath. The long finger is being the pencil pillow. The pencil is laying on top of the long finger. Thank you, long finger, for being the pencil pillow. That is so nice. Okay, look here, we have a nice circle. The thumb is a little bent and making a nice circle shape. We like that circle shape for holding pencils. Oh, and look at these two fingers underneath. They're sleeping in the hand. They're tucked in, they're so cozy. We don't need those fingers for writing, so they're gonna be tucked in there. Wow, that is just such a beautiful pencil pinch. Okay, what can we do with this pencil pinch? Well. We'll just start with this paper. Yes, it is a good pencil pinch. It looks good, thank you for checking. The other hand is helping hold the paper. And we'll just start with a circle here. That's a pretty easy shape to start with. I wonder what it's going to be. Um, let's add some lines to it. Oh, I think I might know what this is. Do you know what we're drawing here? I think it's a sun. Okay, we're drawing lines around the sun. That's a good thing to do with our pencil pinch. Okay, um, let's draw over here two little circles. I have to move my hand a little bit to hold my paper down. Two little circles. I'm gonna put a rectangle on top and I'm gonna give it this line. Oh, I think I know what this is. I think it is a person it looks like they're pushing something. They look, uh, they're wearing a little farmer hat. They're looking pretty happy. Oh, it's because they're mowing the grass. Oh, it's a beautiful sunny day. They're so happy to be mowing the grass. Oh, make sure you hold your, your paper down with your anchor hand so it stays still. Okay, what else can we draw here? I'm going to draw a long oval here and I'm going to give it a little circle. Oh, I think it's gonna be an animal of some kind. Little triangles for ears. It is a happy animal, great. Uh, it has a tail and it has some legs. Okay, you can draw legs with little lines or you can make them like little curves like this. I think it's a cat or maybe even a leopard. It appears to have spots. So let's give that leopard some spots to practice the perfect pencil pinch while making little circles and drawing spots. That's a happy looking leopard. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, we have a few other things we can draw. I'm going to make another circle here and uh, I'm gonna put a nice fat line. I'm drawing a lot of lines together to make a fat line and it is Oh, it looks like a lollipop is growing out of this yard. So uh, we're gonna give it a spiral. If spirals are hard, you can always draw circles instead, but we'll try that spiral if we can. That's a really pretty lollipop. And uh, we'll also draw this cloud up here with 
rain, rain, rain. All these lines are making rain. So many lines. It's all good practice for the perfect pencil pinch. So once you have your perfect pencil pinch, as you can see, you have it there, and you can always try it again with it on the paper. You just pinch it up. You pinwheel it around. The perfect pencil pinch. You can draw pictures. You can write your name. I hope you love it. Thank you.